That means you get two bonus happy points! Yippee! These scary park patrols sure are crowd pleasers! Keep up the good work and soon you won't be able to keep the visitors away! We can do it, Chibi Robo! Well, we'll mostly be you, but we'll be ready for you! Alrighty then! Let's turn those happy points into what's! Uh, make it stop! Let's recharge next! You're fully charged now! Let's see how many flowers you've planted out there! 35! Almost to 40! Your flower count has gone from 21 to 35! Let me check with the next item is Kennedy. We know it's five, you idiot. By the way, Chibi Robo, you want to save now? Yes, I do. Something I do quite like, though, about the sound design of this game is it very much copies the same sound effects from the first game. Except the saving. There's no hoover. There's no hoover when it's done. I'm expecting a or something, but nope. Absolutely nothing. But Oh, well, let's continue. Alrighty, then. It's up to you to make the park explode with flowers, so let's go! Alright, let's get going. What's up, guys? It's Daz here. But you don't really care. Now, let's talk about progress in this game, because progress is entirely based on how many flowers are a bloomin'. If you want to progress the story, you have to just grow flowers, and that is how things go. There are certain marks at each point, like we've already seen 20 and 40 are the specific marks we need to do to make some progress. So today, we might actually do quite a bit of jumping ahead in time, because the next thing we need to do, or the next thing I want to do specifically, is open up a whole story element of this game that's going to be coming up soon. But in order to do that, I need 80 flowers first, I believe. So... I might have to do a whole bunch of montaging right at the very beginning, but I thought I'd explain exactly why I'm doing it first, because it's kind of important to have that kind of communication. So what I'm going to do for the next few bits is I'm going to grow a couple more flowers so that we can get the next marker at 40, and we already have 35, so I really just need to grow five more flowers. I might have already done it for all I know, but I'll see you in a moment when we go and get that reward. <laughs> All right, we're back again. Did a little bit of flower blooming on the side. Let's see how we're doing. What I do? Alrighty, and that is 50, 40, 48. Okay, that's fine. That wasn't really good much more. All right. item that we will get later. I don't really want to get it right now. Oh, I guess I technically kind of spoiled something. The next marking point we want, I believe, is... Actually, it might only be 60. Something happens at 60, something happens at 80. Do excuse me if that counts as a spoiler to you, but oh well. Clippers are now available. They allow us to clip flowers out of the park and then deliver them to people and or the flower shop. The flower shop will give you Tons and tons of happy points if you give them the correct coloured flower on certain days. That's a thing that we'll come to in another video. I don't want to do it today because we won't have time to do everything we want to do today. Sorry for the silence, that's me just being extra careful. Obviously the higher the score, the more seeds you grow, and so naturally I want to do quite well with that. Now, you may be noticing that I'm not actually staying in the same place to spread all these flowers. I'm kind of trying to spread them out awfully easily, or just awfully, that makes sense too. And that's because there's a flaw with the system of how this game's designed that throws me in a pit the first few times I've played this. I haven't played that much anyway, but still, you know what I mean. And that is, if you decided to grow all the flowers on one single square to the point where you grew 30, 
Then the next four squares around it, or I guess three squares around it so that there's a big, bigger square of four, all become green. And when there's green grass on the floor, no more flowers actually grow. So you'd only have flowers in one corner of the park, and no more would be able to grow in the other four corners that are green. It's a really weird concept, but it basically means that the flowers aren't spread evenly at all. So I like spreading out because it makes me feel like I'm more progressive, I guess, like more successful in actually spreading the flowers. So I'm running around as much as I can to get a nice even amount of flowers everywhere because then it just it just feels more satisfying. Now, something else you may be noticing, actually, I got a lot of extra happy points as I was growing up these flowers. And that's because there is a combo meter in the top left hand corner and if I sprout a certain amount of flowers quick enough then the combo goes higher and I get more happy points the higher that counter is. I just got four that time and then it goes to five. Oh, well there's another 30. Look at that, that's a lot more spread out. It's a lot nicer. I could have just kept them all in one corner but I chose not to. Because it looks better. Right. Now let's go pack away and I'm going to go to the thing again to see what the 60 what reward is. I'll see you over there. What a surprise, it's Dot on 60. How did I know? How does anyone? Let me check when the next time is scheduled to arrive. Mm, uh, looks like Citrus of Heaven can serve a schedule yet. Oh, okay. Right, let's leave it off at that and let's keep going then. Looks like nothing does grow at 60, but 60 is kind of a relevant point because, you know, you hit another patch of green grass. So I guess kind of something happened at 60, but oh well. Right. At this point, is, is the sun going down? No, I guess that's just my own color blood is making me think it's darker than usual. All right. Now that we've made everything grassy around here, let's go and progress forward towards this bridge, shall we? Jamie, you run out, are you copy? That's a toy bike over there! Oh, oh! Oh, right, right, right! I almost forgot! But not to worry! If we access power projects through the Chibi Bruce PC, we can fix the bridge! Ahem, uh ahem! -huh. I'm preparing it as we speak! Just leave it to me! Alright, in that case, let's go to Chet. After all, we've left it to him, and there aren't exactly flowers to bloom anymore. We've kind of completed this area. The other parts of the land we can't grow flowers in simply because they're out of bounds. If they're not on fertile soil, they won't grow. They'll only give you happy points. Oh, oh, I almost forgot! When you raise lots of flowers in a given area, that land transforms into a green space! When that happens, white flowers transform into coloured flowers. Yeah, and flower buds turn into happy points. Talk about a happy happening. When the entire park is made up of green spaces. Well, I won't ruin it for you. You'll see for yourself what happens then. Uh, uh, okay, do I... Am I missing something? You said you were organising it yourself. Do I need to grow some flowers? Do you come back next day and do it? I'm a little, little lost now. Uh, give me a moment, excuse me. Here we go, I had to charge in apparently. Oh, um, Hibby. If you want to fix that bridge over there? Well, that actually falls under the park project heading, you know? And it's ready to go at all, but um... I need a cartridge in order to get it started! You just put it into that nifty machine over there to use it, but the thing is... I lost them all! How? You're a face! I'm so sorry! It's all my fault! I take full responsibility for this! I must have dropped them on the trip here! I hate to ask you to do this, but, um, Chibi Robo, would you go look for them in town for me? Yeah. I knew you were a good egg, Chibi Robo! You're the best! So, by the way, Chibi Robo, do you want to say that? No, I don't. Get out of here. <laughs> I'll get out of here. Whatever. Alrighty, come on then. 
So the cartridges, huh? Let's go to a new area we've never been to. Sacre bleu! Bonjour, très bien, et merci! Oh, 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 oh. it is uh, the most beautiful of days! Ah, oui. Another day, another town, another chance for the happiness. Oh, hamburgerie. Bien, bien. I will visit it later. And there is a flower shop, how very lovely. Perhaps this town holds the key to my freedom. Smuggler attack. Zapow! What is this? Sacre bleu. I feel as if I am on my last legs now. The freedom that is all I ever wanted. Well now, let's go and save the guy. But first, no matter what you do, I think Chad always comes out to say this. Before crossing the street, you almost got squished. When the signal turns green, that's your cue to go. Thank you, teaching kids how to cross the road even now. Except the wait's quite a while, and we are on like a time limit with days and nights and all that. Come on, please. Come on, we just need one more card. There we go. Thank you. Right. So let's go and see this lovely marionette. He's in this box right here. You found someone. This does look dodgy, I have to admit, but that's how it works. Ah, I feel as if I just ate a 9 volt battery, in a good way, but of course. It's never the less. When will I be free of these strings? When? Oh, oh pardon as moi. Bonjour, monsieur robot. My name is Francois. I travel the world searching for my freedom. I am a marionette and a magician from France. The petite robot saves the day. Mercy. Oh, now I remember. I found a cartridge. Does it belong to you? Yes, yes it does. Très bien, monsieur. In that case, I will give it to you if you bring me something sweet. Do I not count? Aww. If you look around town, you should be able to find some sweets. Sacre bleu. Well, well then. Alright. Sweets it is. In order to do that, also it feels like it's kind of nighttime around here, so I really better run. 
what we need to do is go around this back alley here. You can't quite tell it's a back alley, it just looks like the side of a building, but here it is. It's even got rats and everything, if, if, if you call that a rat. Interestingly, there is an actual plug outlet here. I'm not sure why there would be one outside of a building, and I mean, I guess there are like modern buildings that have USB things sticking out of them so that you can charge up, but I don't know. Anyway, here is what we need. Candy cane. Jamie Robo, do you copy? Here's the lowdown on items. After you pick up an item, you can toss it forward by sliding the tire stylus up. Put it down by sliding the stylus down. To store it in your head, just tap the store icon in the lower left corner. Give it a try! Not really sure why this is a major mechanic that they had to point out, but yeah, you can throw items. Uh, cool. Like so. Chiba Robo's got quite the arm, I have to admit though. It's kind of surprising, isn't it? Anyway, now that we're coming back to that lovely, peaceful town music, let's go give this to Francois. Oh, he's so all the way over there. Come on, I can see it's kind of night time around here. Please hurry up. You know it's the end of the day when it starts dinging at you, so let's get going, please. Oh, 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 I have to put it away first. Come on, talk to me. Bonjour, bonjour, Robo. Oh, sacré bleu. Is that a candy cane you have there? Ah, that would really hit the spot. What say you? Can I have the? See vous plaît? Yeah, sure. Yum yum. He even eats in French. See candy cane. It is a thing of beauty. Merci beaucoup. Well, a deal is a deal, no? Repairs cartridge. Would you turn around for a moment, won't you, Robo? Let me see what it says. The software is designed for park projects. That is all it says. I must admit, I have no idea what that means. Anyway, to thank you for helping me. Please do not hesitate to call me if you need anything. I would like very much to help you in the future. With my magic, there is nothing I cannot do. Except cut off strings, apparently. Sacre bleu! You can find me in the alley, Monsieur Robot. Alright, and that was the bulk of what I wanted to do today. Today is all about making new friends. Even if it is that guy. And, yeah, we're not getting home in time. Also, it was green and a car just, like, drove past. That's murderous. But, oh well. Good job, Chibi, but look at the time. Come on back. You've worked enough for today, so why don't you head back to the Chibi house now? What do we got? 71 buds, three visitors, and I, I don't really care about the colors too much. And then I'm going to end it off there. Episodes always end when the day ends. I just forget to say my outro. Oops. Anyway, from now, my name's been Daz, you didn't really care, and I'll see you in a bit.